Well, hello lads and ladies. I hope you're doing well. We're here once again with a squad review. This week it is going to be the team of the week like it is most Wednesdays. What I want to say to you before I even get into this video, guys, is I know there's a team of the year also. It's Southern Europe, I believe they've called it. If you want me to review that, give you my opinions, tell you what I think of the players, put a comment down below. And then I'll, you know, if I get more saying yes than no, then I'll, I'll, I'll bring that to you tomorrow. So, got a few ideas for the channel coming up soon as well. Some I can't say, some I can. Obviously, they'll be Freestyle Friday. If you're watching this and you haven't seen one of those, please do watch them. I'm really trying to get those uh, popular on the channel. But we're here for the squad review this week, so we will jump straight in. It looks like it's been made for me. A lot of silvers and a lot of bronze. Certainly the silvers, I open a lot of silver packs, so I might be opening quite a few of those this week. So, we'll jump straight up here with the striker. McCarthy, don't know too much about him to be honest with you, but 75 pace, 82 shooting, 75 dribbling and 79 heading, not bad stat at all. Uh, he plays, is that the Orlando Pirates? I think, possibly, I'm not sure, I mean these are very weird in forms, obviously not the best ever top rated of 84, it's not the best team of the week, but you know, we'll, we'll go through Sigurdsson. Uh, 80 pace, 75 shooting, 75 dribbling, 81 heading. Not that much better than that silver, to be honest. I don't see this guy going for much at all. Uh, just, is that D Rosario? I think he's been in form before. If not, I've definitely seen a couple of his cards go before. 86 shooting is pretty good, to be honest, with 80 dribbling. N again, I don't think any of these are going to be seriously expensive, guys. Um, you know, we'll have to see. Uh, this right wing right mid sorry 75 pace 72 shooting 80 passing pretty meow stats you know probably about 12,000 10 to 12,000 another one from the Russian league though uh, Payet uh, pretty solid stats you know the four stats in the 80s 84 passing 84 dribbling 82 shooting and 82 or 84 pace sorry and 82 passing nice little card obviously plays for Lille here same team as Eden Hazard uh, a lot of controversy going around with Hazard right now uh, is that Johnny Tarker uh, 90 pace, a lot of people are going to be raping that pace, 84 shooting, 82 dribbling, and 18, very good left wing, very, very good actually, those stats are very nice. Uh, is that Thiago Motta? Slow pace, probably not going to be expensive for that reason. 81 passing, 83 defending, and 85 heading, those stats are good, but I think the pace is really going to let him down. Uh, Og Bonner, uh, 84 pace for a centre back, good, people are going to like him straight away, with the 85 defending and 84 heading, so not a bad card. Uh, Calif, not going to be expensive at all. Probably discard value. The pace of 40, no one's going to really want him for their team. Uh, USA teams are 90% dominated with Win and Opara as the two centre-backs. This guy doesn't beat either of those two. So I don't see him really doing very well. This guy, I'm not even going to try and say his name. Uh, Centre-mid, okay. I suppose his passing and dribbling are the standout stats. The others aren't that great. Uh, Sanchez in goal, 86 diving, 72 handling, 84 reflexes, 74 positioning. You know, okay, middle of the road goalkeeper. I mean, the starting 11 really isn't anything to scream about and write home about. I can't believe there's going to be that many, if any, maybe Johnny Tarker, that are that far above discard value. To be honest, 15,000 is probably the most for those. But we'll start with a bench. What have we got here? Another random goalkeeper, Orion. 84 positioning is quite a good start to be honest. Toshe, is that Olympiakos or Panthenaikos? Sorry, 80. Shooting is not bad. Pace lets him down. Uh, I don't recognise really any of these. I mean, is it? Oh, of course, the English league's finished. That's why there's none this week. But, there's, you know, right back and a centre back. I mean, McGuinness. Typical Irish <laughs> McGuinness there. But uh, none, of the, none of the players, guys. I'm a little bit disappointed. In fact, I'm a huge bit disappointed with the the informs this week. Let me know what you think. I believe this is probably the worst team of the week we've had, but I know they're obviously making team of the year and man of the match drug bear and things, the more prominent things. So let me know what you think of this team, guys, down below. Let me know who you want and why. Uh, I'm thinking payout this week for me. Uh, don't really have a reason why, but I would just like him. A couple of things I want you to do, guys. I will be streaming tonight, so please swing by the stream. Uh, I'll put a video on the channel as well, but there's a, a link in the description. So if you want to click that and go and follow, you'll be notified by email when I start streaming. So hopefully you enjoy the video, guys. Remember to put a comment if you want to see Team of the Year review by me. It's probably a better option to review them anyway. And also drop a like on the video. It means a lot to me if you guys can do that. So other than that, hope you have a good evening, guys, and I'll speak to you all tomorrow.